Hello, my name is Mehdi Razwan and I'm a staff engineer at Sartec and today I'll be showing you guys how to import an image into NX using the raster image function. In front of you guys, you guys have a 2x2x2 two by two by two cube that I've extruded off of the XY plane. And let's say perhaps I want to place the Sartec logo on top of this cube so that I can model with it. No problem. If I come here under the datum plane tab and click on that tab extension, I can find the raster image function. Let's say I forget where to find the raster image function, no problem. I can go ahead and click on the command finder here and look up import image, for example. And the command finder will give me options based on what it believes is the solution that I'm looking for. And as you can see, that is correctly guessed where that function is and it also shows me where that function is for future reference let's say if this becomes a common tool in my modeling arsenal I'm going to go ahead and click on this function and I'll come up with a dialog box on the left here which will specify the plane in which I want to place the image ask me for what image I want to place it in and then the orientation I'm going to go ahead and click on this top face here I don't need an offset, so that's not a problem. I'm going to click on the image file here, click on the Saratech logo, and press OK. And it will come up with a preview of my image. Uh, as you guys can see, it's a little bit too large for that cube. So let's see if we can uh, change the size to better match our application. Maybe half an inch is a good size. Uh, well, as you can see, it's a little bit too small. So let's try one inch. And still it's a little bit too small. So let's try two inches. Actually, let's try 1.95 inches because we still want some space between the logo and the sidewalls if we were to center it, which I plan on doing. Well, now that I'm here, I can go ahead and click hold and drag this base point to the location that I want it to. And this base point will also lock to uh, edges and geometric features um, based on the uh, smart uh, locking you'll see here or enable snap point um, let's say I want to base it off of the center I can always click on middle center and it'll move the base point to the center of the image um, and drag the image to that base point so I think this is good I'm gonna go ahead and press K here And there you go, you have an image on your 2x2 two two cube for modeling purposes. Thank you, and if you have any questions, please contact Saratech.